Hello, welcome to Cloud Channel. In this module, we will learn how to connect to Snowflake in Power BI Desktop. So uh, I will show you how to connect to a Snowflake computing warehouse from Power BI Desktop to. In Power BI Desktop, we can connect to a Snowflake computing warehouse and use the underlying data just like any other data source in Power BI Desktop. So I will log into Snowflake account and I will create a warehouse and I will just check the table and how many rows we have. And I will try to access the table from Power BI desktop tool. I'm in the Snowflake account right now. So I will go to warehouses and I will click on create and I will create one warehouse. I will I will mention the name as warehouse 01 and I will choose the size as smallest one and auto suspend five minutes and auto resume and I will add a comment this is test warehouse and I will create this warehouse it should be ready in seconds now I will go to databases what databases we have we have Snowflake sample data database and util, util underscore database. So I will go to worksheets and I will try to access from the Snowflake sample data. And let's just select one schema, SF100 TCO. So I will just, we can just keep our cursor on the table and we can get all the details. And here we can see on the web page, we can see created. We can see the creation date 9-14-2018 and the timestamp and how many rows it has and the size, the size of the table. So I will select the warehouse and warehouse 01 and database Snowflake and the schema is SF100 TCL. So I will just run the count how many table it has, uh, how many rows it has. And from web page table web underscore page and we will try to access this table from power bi i'll just run one query so we have total 5004 records in this table so now i will go to power bi and log in through power bi and access this data so let me go to power bi so once we are in the power bi tool we can go to option file click on file and click on get data and here we can say get data to get started click on get data to get started now we see all the options file database power platform azure so i will select database option and under the database, we should see all the source databases, Teradata, Sybase, MySQL, Netiza, Amazon Redshift, Google BigQuery, and Snowflake. I will select Snowflake and click on Connect. Now we need to enter our server details and which warehouse we need to connect. So how do we get the server name? So I will go back to Snowflake and I will go to this address bar and select this Snowflake address. I will copy this Snowflake server address and go to Power BI, enter the server name and the warehouse is warehouse 01. And I will leave other options. These are all optional. And the data connectivity mode, we can connect through import data or we can connect to direct query so i will choose here the import click ok so now i will get uh so now i'm automatically log into this uh snowflake server uh but normally we get um, a pop-up details username and password and we need to enter our username and password to connect to the snowflake so now i will go to this snowflake sample data and go to this sf100 tcl schema and web page so this is the data we just ran in snowflake and which we had about 5004 records in this table so now i will just select this 
and I can load this or transform. Let me just click on load. And we can create a, a dashboard uh, based on our need. So this is just like, you know, how we can uh, connect to Snowflake from, from Power BI and how we can build the report. So here we can see all the options here. So we can select the visualization pie chart or donut chart, like, you know, our multi-row card. So we can select whatever we want. So line chart, just select and then click like, you know, select the fields. So we can build our dashboards according to our needs. So I was just trying to show you like, you know, how we can connect to Snowflake from Power BI. And here, if we want to see the data, so we can just select the option data. So here we can see all the attributes here. And if we want to build any dashboard, so we can select here. I will just select pie chart and I can extend this pie chart and then select the date. So uh, let me go back to Snowflake. So pretty much what we see here in the Snowflake table, so we can get all the data from the, um, we can access all data from the Power BI. So I will just click on preview data here. So all the attributes here we can see. So the same thing we see here in Power BI and we can build the dashboard. And so far in this module, we covered um, how to connect to Snowflake computing warehouse from Power BI desktop tool. So I created warehouse and I ran some queries in Snowflake. Then I opened Power BI desktop tool and enter the Snowflake server name and enter my credentials, my Snowflake username and password to connect to Snowflake. And I select the table and I use this import connectivity, import data connectivity mode to connect to Snowflake. And I loaded all the data. So, and we went through like, you know, all the visualization, how we can select the visualization and how we can build the sample uh, dashboard. And also, if we want to see the data, we can uh, change this uh, option. And if you have any questions on this, how to connect to Snowflake from Power BI, please post them in the comments. If you want to know how to build a dashboard using Power BI, like, you know, connect to any source, how we can build a sample dashboard, there is one module available in my channel. So please go through that Power BI module, then you will learn how to create a sample dashboard. And if you still have any questions, please post them here uh, in the comments. If you like this video, please subscribe and share the channel. Thank you.